Hi everyone, Farmer Kit here and today we're doing something really really fun. It's going to be with our meerkats who are going to be really enjoying the sunshine we've got today but to make it an extra special day for them we thought we'd give them a little bit of a party. So it's the summer time, you know, it's the time for parties and today we're going to be using some um, ball pool balls. Now we've actually um, pinched these from the soft play area because their ball pool isn't open yet so we've sterilised these and we use them quite a bit for our meerkats and mongoose to kind of have some fun with. And what I thought I'd do is have a little bit of a ball pool party. I've got some of these and we've got some tasty treats as well. So let's see how it goes. Hello, are we going to have some fun? All right, so I'm going to fill this up. There we go. And then um, I've got some tasty Morio worms. So I'm going to put these in here so we've got to kind of go in and find them. Now it is kind of a bit of enrichment for them because we want them to be working for the food, not just kind of always pick it up off the ground all the time. So they're probably going to have to figure out, they might actually have to dive in to get these worms. So we'll see how it goes. Who's going to be the brave one? It's really important for wild animals like meerkats to have the opportunities to express natural behaviours they would in the wild. Now in the wild they're not going to be coming across a play pool like this but it just kind of simulates like the behaviours they'll have to replicate like them using their brains to figure out how to get food that's not always going to be easy to come by. They're naturally very curious animals so they always want to investigate new things which is why we try to do like put in a lot of new things for them to explore and they're very very smart when it comes to where food is. Guys are you gonna who's gonna be first? So the meerkats aren't being as brave as I hoped they'd be so what I might end up doing is put it against one of these rock structures to give them like a little bit of a ledge to go in a little bit easier and I may well take a few of these out just so they can see the worms at the bottom so do you want me to like take it a bit easier for you? Yeah let's try that. Right, okay, come on, we're going to move over here. If you go over here, look, you've got a nice little platform you can go in on. Go. It took a little bit of convincing and a little bit of patience, but I'm really glad our meerkats kind of took the initiative, saw some food and thought, you know, I want that. I need to. I need to work this situation out so that you can see them manipulating um, those ball pool balls, and that's really, really good to see. Meerkats are kind of known diggers, so kind of manoeuvring things out the way is like a really good like mental skill for them to use. I'm so happy our meerkats had like an enjoyable time using this enrichment here. So what we're going to have to do is come up with a few more ideas, I think, to keep our animals like mentally and physically stimulated. So if you've got any other ideas, you'll have to let us know. And if you enjoy these kind of videos as well you have to let us know if you'd like to see a few more of them because we do do quite a few things but we're not we're not always sure whether you guys would want to watch them or not so thank you for watching and from me and these meerkats we'll see you next time bye